第一話アンニュイナミツキ Hello, everybody, back again. Here we are with Mitsuki's chapter. A lot of people haven't won this one, so here we are. Now the premier judgment was over, there was one more week until summer vacation. There wasn't anything else in particular to discuss, but we all gathered together at Marie Hall after school. This place was generally reserved for association members, if that is members of a,、uh, the, like the White Lily and the Red Rose members. So it was the perfect spot for me to relax. Maybe it's because I feel so relieved after making it through Premier Judgment, but this team tastes so much better than usual. Do you know how much it hurts to see your face right now? I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That, no, I'm sorry. Just been a little stressed out lately. Didn't mean to take it out on you. Did you change the tea leaves or something? This is the usual Forts Num and Mason, right? When it came to black tea, I had always held those cheap tea bags in high regard, but lately my tastes had become more refined and particular. Tama wa onaji desu. Then what's different? Oyo wakastoki, watakushi no jone mo isho ni nitatete imasu no de. Stop being so damn cute. Nani yo sore wa? Jone ente ne. Jone ente ye ba, Masaya kun, minna kara kurai jone o buzke rare tari shi nakata? Boy, have they. I can't get enough of it. What's with that? I could shot an oddly heavy glance my way, but I didn't know what she meant by it. That was not intentional. What about it? By smooth, she wasn't talking about a real kiss, of course. Before Premier Judgment, Marika revealed the truth of what had really happened back then in front of the entire school. それがなんて言っちゃダメだって相手はあの大輪の花グランデフルールよ今年から生徒会長で人気はますます盤石つまりマサヤくん呪ってやるとかの手紙を送りつけられたりしたんじゃないの、oh, I just throw all those away <laughs> No, of course not うんなんだつまんないの You're right, that is boring I'm sorry. I'll try to make my life a little more exciting for you next time. Please don't use me to entertain yourself. Sounds like very terrible love if you ask me. It's with Suko. Marika Sama no Ninki. 確かにすごいものがありますマーサヤも相当に喜んでいたもんね Well,、uh, I really don't think so じゃあ嬉しくなかったのジューされて I wouldn't say that やっぱりね No, I think I know what it is I wasn't so happy I described it with the adjective reasonably. I guess that's. there is that aspect to it. It was then, while we were amusing ourselves with idle conversation. Why are y'all blurry? Focus! Thank you. We suddenly heard a depressed sigh and all focused our attention in the direction of the noise. Mitsuki san? Do you want to go? No, it's not. That is a lie and you know it. No girl ever says, oh, it's nothing. It's always something. Always. Mm-hmm. Cop? 
ップにゴミでも入ってしまったんですかううん、うん、ごめんなさい何でもないのよ気にしないで It took her quite awkwardly now that everyone's attention was focused on her It appeared to be an accidental sigh, so it seemed it wasn't her intention for us to deliberately listen to her. Or maybe it was. Marika's <laughs> kiss was really shocked at her. Ah. Can you hear me? I can hear you too. Ah, ah, sorry. And then, look. あなた、マリカとは大の仲良しというか、第一の信奉者だったから。それは、もう。不幸の手紙を送らないまでも、書くところまでは言ったわけしません、そんなこと。でも、綾香様、美月さんはもう、親衛隊長は卒業したんですよ。ね。ええ、そうねシェフドコールの方が強そうで私としては好きでしたもん。Oh, you can cook? Interesting. I thought you were actually a bad cook. No, that chef does not mean cook in French. Good to know. 強いって言われても嬉しくないのよ。I don't know French, alright? Tear of the Moon, alright. I know Lune meant Moon, but I didn't know what Armad meant. Combination of her teardrop beauty mark and her name. Mitsuki equals beautiful moon. Ah! Oh, that's cool, I didn't know that. Learn something new every day. Arigato. Mitsuki, I've been on the show for five years. This stranger makes a good argument. Naki Bokuro te, Nakanaka Fixi the Monone. The cap of my favorite reference. Show is so funny. Ah, You're right about that. I looked over at Mitsuki. There was a mold rippling beneath her eye on her smooth, lily white cheek. It definitely did look sexy. I never noticed a mole on her. Yeah, I was never with the whole beauty mark thing. I guess it works for some people, but yeah. I mean, it's not a not bad. It's just like, yeah. Oh, sorry. So, I'm not going to get it. 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 It wasn't really. やっぱり言われて嬉しかったわけなのね。人の顔をチロチロ見るものではないということを言いたかっただけです。That's true. You shouldn't stare at people. It's bad. Oh my god. さやさん、私なら構いませんよ。I'll stare you all day long, honey. What? I know, I know you're sad. I'm sorry. I, I really wanted to finish your route. I really did. Don't, don't, don't do this to me. You're right. Kiyo,ne.Kore,de,shore,i,wa,hakujo,ni,da,te,na,le,mas.Nakiyo,toshka. <laughs> No, you can't do it the way she can. See, now you just look stupid. I'm not trying to make funny faces here, alright? No, no. Well, we're gonna hear that again because that was hilarious. One more time for good measure. Alright. 
ストレートでいいわね美月様どうかしたのですかあううん何でもおかわりのお茶入れてくるわねうん What? Stop that. <laughs> the hell's wrong with you two? Every competition's a competition for yours, truly. Well. That's something. So, Mitsuki. Is, uh, she's acting really weird, but she doesn't want to tell anybody why. Why can't you ask me now? Advice for what? Sure. Yeah. Advice, huh? That was the first time she said something like that to me since we first met. What could it be about, I wonder? Now I was curious. After dinner, I headed toward the recreation room and the other members of the White Whaler Society were already gathered. When I took a seat on the sofa, Rise began by saying, She has been acting a little funny. You were there. I was ああ。<笑> ちほさんにだけは言われたくないわね。何よ。まあ、まあ、まあ。ね、ビフェとしては、みつきの様子が気になっていたわけなのね。うん。まあ、確かに元気がなかったかな。まさやくんに泣き袋がいいって言われた時
I actually know more French than I take give myself credit for. C'est la vie. But as far as everyone else was concerned, that's probably all there was to it. The same went for me, too. Larissa had gathered everyone together like this and asked for our advice. It would appear Ayaka was thinking the same thing I was. それ Come on, that's a little big uh, difference there. Think back on the night. Ah, uh, yes, I remember it just like it was yesterday. That night I got an email from Risa. She wanted me to head there for her meeting with Mitsuki. And so, the approximate time, I slipped out of the veranda and headed for the Rose Garden. Hey, what's up? Why would she hurt her? That's silly. Why Okay, for those of you who don't know what happened, this is, this is basically the part of the story where Marika came into our room, basically, or not in our room, I think it was like classroom or something. Basically came on to us and then all of a sudden tried to play the victim like she was, like we were like assaulting her sexually. Now we know, we know that that was all, you know, BS and we're confronting her. Mitsuki was doing her best to sound outraged, but even in the faint moonlight, I could see that her beautiful face was warped with guilt. Well, you know that I know the truth, after all. やっぱり証言してくれないの証言事件は作られたものだということをはっ、バカバカしい。Mitsuki turned to leave, but Risa caught her arm. 待ちなさいよ。話して。そうはいかないわ。さっきも言ったわよね。ボートは明日だって。こちらも手を込まねえているわけにはいかないの。やっぱり叩いてでも言わせたいことを言わせようというのね。いい加減にして。ねえ、みつきさん。ちゃんと私と向き合って。ここで逃げられたら、もう私たち二度と仲直りでき
マサヤさんの方向に賛成の立場なのえもちろん今回のことに関してではなくてよ一学期最後のプルミエールジャッジメントあるいはグランデボートにおいても変革には反対の立場を取るのかどうかと聞いているのそんなこと決まっているじゃない We want to hear from you. それは本当にあなたの考えとして<笑> She had said something similar before. She wondered if Mitsuki was just falling along with Marika. 今回マサヤさんを罠にかけたことでやっぱり私の考えに間違いはなかったんだということが分かったわ美月さんの行動はマリカ様に強く影響され引きずられているそれがどうしたというの You're just a puppet, can't you see? She's pulling the strings 認めるのねそんなこと一言も言ってやしないわ大体いいあなたは間違った前提に立っているのだからわん<笑>ねえ美月さん Risei spoke to her in a hushed voice. I just thought you were the one who was 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 the 明らかに違うそういう間柄ではない思えば私この問題に正面から向き合うことを避けてきたんだわなぜって何が出てくるか分からなかったんだもの怖かったんだもの美月さんも同じじゃないまあね一体何が悪かったのかしら私が悪かったの、うん、私、ほんと言って、寂しかったのよ。リセさん。美月さんが離れていくようで、寂しかった。私なんて親しい友人もいないし、もちろん、数の多い少ないが問題ではないけれど。As far as I could see, Rise wasn't unpopular. On the contrary, as Soleil de Cole, she was extremely popular. But a pestle could be isolating in its own way. That was probably why she didn't have any close friends. Only so many can stand at the top of the ladder, after all. まみつきさんとむかしみたいになかよしになりたいっておもってる。Bit of red came into Mitsuki's cheeks. みつきさんはどうかしら ?It took her a long time to answer.Mitsuki turned her eyes straight to the ground and wrestled out the words with effort. わたしだって。Her shoulders slumped and she bowed her head slightly. Go men, as I get to eke and I know what does she know you? Eh? Tandanto Anatano Kotoga Mabusco Natis Matano. Tona Koto de Moichimoko, Kareus on Zaino Lisa Sanga Mabusco Natis Matano. おかしいわよね。私たちはいつだって一緒だったのに。それでこう、はあ。それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、そうね
私も言いこぶって否定はできないわ私の一命誇りに思ったのは事実だものでも少なくとも私たちの間にはそんなものないと思っていたそれは本当なのよ美月さんええそれは分かってるだってリセさんは私の一命に疑問を持たなかったみたいだからえ私ね私後期に上がって早々周りのささやき声を聞いてしまったのよ太陽と月悲しいくらいにお似合いじゃないとそれはミツキスフォーマータイトルはメイデルーン That's right That's why I made her so upset back then Chief Decor is it I believe that was your earlier title was far more beautiful You really do mean that, don't you? I was a complete stranger. I was a friend of my friend. I didn't think I was like that. Wait, Mitsuki. I'm not a friend of my friend. I'm a friend of my friend. Yes, I understand. That's why I'm not a bad thing. 私はもっと高みに行きたかったでもそれは別にリセさんを見返してやりたいとかじゃなくてただ対等になりたかっただけなのあなたとねえ self deriding smile appeared on Mitsuki's lips <笑>馬鹿げているわよね私のやったことはむしろ低い方へと流れていくことだったのにもちろんお姉様マリカ様には元から憧れがあったわでもそれだけではなかったことを私,私はむしろ積極的にシェフドコールを自称してそれがヒエラルキーを登ることだと信じて。ラルムドリュヌの方が素敵だったそれは本当なのよええ私も途中からそう思うようになったわでも今 You don't need to take it back あ、uh, sorry I didn't mean to interrupt いえ Since I already done it though I decided to continue Whether it's Marika's or anyone else's, I think it's good to have friends. So why not leave that as it is? And just do the best you can for your association, Mitsuki. Eh? You've given the leadership over to Ritsuko, but you can work hard to support her. She's clearly nervous about being a first year student serving as society leader. She needs all the help she can get, poor girl.、Oh. Just have a fair fight between associations. I think that would be a way for your friendship to be equal, like you said before. Mitsuki blinked rapidly several times as she listened to me, then she burst out laughing. Huh. I guess it was a weird thing to say. I tilted my head in confusion. I didn't say anything. Huh? Nate, Masaya san was Shira Yuri Kai n a n d a k a r No, I guess so, but you can't have a fair fight alone. You need an opponent, it's no fun. Demo, Makereba, Anata wa Koko dete i k a n a k e r e b n a r a n a i no yo. Then I leave. But no matter what happens, I think it's always better to enjoy school, Mitsuki. Oh. My life at school last year was really boring. Like, you don't even know. So I believe that from the bottom of my heart. So if you aren't enjoying your time at school right now, then I think we should change that. So, ne? 
アソシアシオも面白そうねきっとね私なんか2年生に上がってからというもの毎日が楽しくて仕方がないもの We play cards on weekends ね Yeah <laughs> We need another bridge player What do you say? Smile appeared on Mizuki's lips and she fixated on me with a serious gaze あなたは確かに少なくとも隣人ではあるのかもしれないわねその先のことは今はまだわからないけれど Mitsuki folded her arms and thought for a time リセさん最初の質問に答えるわえ私の考え実際のところ私は今までは男子なんていらないって思ってた You know, でも今は。To kind of interject a little bit, I always thought this was kind of a weird kind of mindset to have. Like, what happens when these girls go out into the real world? You know, they can't be at the school forever. So, what happens when they go out and intermingle with, you know, with men or boys or whatever? You know, it's like, what's going to happen then? These girls are taught to like be afraid of them this whole time. And it's like, it's kind of, kind of tyrannical, really, the way the headmistress is kind of making boys seem to be like this horrible thing. Masaya san n a r a いてもいいかって思ってる<笑>。私自身の考えがそうなった以上、もう嘘はつけないわね。嘘をついてまで追い出したいとは、今はもう思えないから。マサヤさん、リセさん、正直に言うわ。確かにあの事件は、私たちが仕組んだものだったのごめんなさい you got all that on tape, right? お姉さまマリカさま We thought she might be in the bathroom so we waited several minutes after knocking but there was no response 変ねいらっしゃらないのかしら Mitsuki placed her hand on the knob in confusion あら空いてるわお姉さま She announced herself as she entered. I waited alone in the hallway. The others returned shortly. She wasn't there? Recreation room, Kashira. Let's go. It was another miss. We decided to check the bath just to be safe, but Marika wasn't there either. Where could she be at this hour? To the rest of the world, the night was still young. However, at Vincennes, things were different. Classes and club activities were over. There was no reason to leave the dorms. Mitsuki's expression stiffened. そう。お姉さまは何事においても正しい人だから。正しい人。そうね。何か。胸騒ぎがする。ねえ、手分けして探しましょう。ええ。Got it. Let's go. We started to run. We left the path joining the dorms to the school area and split up. A heavy rain began to fall as we ran in search of Marika. But I kept running defiantly. My body was soaked through in an instant. It was cold, too. Where could Marika be? I didn't want to think of her outside of weather like this. <coughs> That voice. Was it from the clock tower? I ran toward it, anxiety swelling inside of me. That was no ordinary scream. When I arrived, a cry leapt from my own throat. Marika! Words of desperation. I heard footsteps approaching from behind me, and a moment later, I was being pulled by the arm. Right. We bolted for the clock tower. The ground has turned spongy, and our progress is maddeningly slow. 
feel like we were running on a trampoline. Lise placed her hand on the entrance of the clock tower. I was seized in the grip of fear. I felt certain that at any minute I was going to hear a thump or a splash down behind me. <laughs> the door opened with a heavy sound. Assaulted by a terrible sense of foreboding, I shut my eyes tight. My sense of foreboding eased as we entered the tower. So this is what it's like in here. Faint light streaming through the windows, making them look like the set of a shadow play. The windows were large enough that I could make out the shape of the room. It was empty, with the staircase running along the wall. <laughs> Mitsuki whispered a prayer as we raced against time. Our footsteps pounded heavily on the iron stairs. There is no railing or Marika, is there? If she fell from that height, she wouldn't survive. Why? Why isn't there a railing? I groaned in frustration. Scenic purposes again. This is also the reason why there's no guardrail station, or sorry, guardian station right by the school gate. It was strange having said it. It could be so strict in some ways and so lenient in others. The fact that I was here was another example. Here I was under house arrest and they kept a close watch on my door. My veranda went unwatched. On one hand, it was good that they trusted the students. On the other hand, they really underestimated them sometimes. Mitsuki, don't start crying just yet. It's bad luck. So, so What? そして辛さを分かち合おうともせず。<笑> Mitsuki bravely wiped her tears away and hardened her expression. We were all out of breath by the time we reached the summit. Risi opened the door. The heavy padlock that fastened it had been removed. We saw Marika beyond. I breathed this initial sigh of relief. But she was still standing right on the ledge, looking out over a long drop. I wasn't acrophobic, but realizing how far the drop would be, I felt overtaken by fear. Mitsuki, you have to calm down. I clasped her hand firmly. Just the slightest shift in balance could cause her to fall. We should speak to her very calmly. Mitsuki took in a deep breath and called out to her again.
the wind. It was raining very hard, soaking my already sweat-drenched body even further. Time seemed to pass by very slowly. It felt like hours before Marika spoke, though in reality, it had likely only been a few seconds. Mitsuki. The rain was still falling hard, but the noise wasn't intrusive, perhaps because there was so little nearby for it to strike. So even amidst the falling sheets of rain, Marika San's softly spoken words still reached us. だから今回私がしたことはどうしても正しいことと思えず。そうなると私がこれまで正しいことと信じてやってきたことも全てはその全ては実際のところそんなことはなかったのかもしれないと。そう、もう何もかもわからなくなってしまって。詰まるところ私は。私自身がわからなくなってしまったんです。お姉様は常に正しかったです。それはそばにいた私が一番知っているつもりです。でも。皆様、ごめんなさい。え神ではない。人は必ず間違いを犯します。大事なことは誤りを誤りと認めて正していくことだと思います。時には自分を見失うことだってあるはずです。そんな時こそ周りが手を差し伸べなければならないのに私はただ見ているだけでした苦悩に気がついていたのに私は何もすることができずこれではシェフドコールの一命が泣きますねそんなことお姉様聞いてください私もさっき自分の誤りに気がついたんですどういうことリセさんのことです私は謝った気持ちから彼女を遠ざけ自分からも離れていったのだということを知りました誤りを知って正して私はとても晴れやかな気持ちになりましたそう だから、お願いです。お姉様も。ええ。あなたの言うことはきっと正しいのでしょうね、ミツキ。Empowered by her words, Mitsuki took a step forward. ただね、ミツキ。あ、あ。She oh, oh. stopped suddenly, the rain dripping down her body.私はずっと信じていたのです。まるで裏切られた気分です。それともこれは呼ぶを見舞ったような神の試練なのでしょうか。そうであれば、まだ救いもあるのですが。いいえ、マリカ様。as the carillon bells rang, Risei spoke for the first time. Marika-sama-no-tadashi-sa-o-hoshou-shite-ita-no-wa-kami-de-wa-nai-hazu-desu. 
顔言っては失礼ですが私はずっと不思議だったんですマリカ様の確信は一体どこから来るのだろうって結果的に正しいか正しくないかはこの際二の次だと思います問題なのは迷わないことなぜって私たちは迷うことの方がむしろ自然のはずだからです迷うことの方がむしろ自然ええなぜでしょうだってそういう年頃ですものそうではありませんかマリカ様ユシスパークウィズスマイルのヘルボイスガジョイスマイルビギンとブレイクトゥーマリカスエクスプレッションオーソそれもそうでしたねリセの言う通りです私はそんな自明のことも忘れてしまっていましたいつからか私は正しくあることを自らのノリとしてきましたそして私をずっと導いてきてくれたのが祖母だったのです確信はそういうことだったのですねええ今回のこともおばあさまの指示ではいリセブリーズファイント I knew it あ、ah, that's right マリカ's grandmother was a Vincennes advisor or something like that ずっと信じてきたのに道しるべを失ったことが悲しいのではありません私のこれまでは何だったのかそれを見失ってしまったことが悲しくてマリカ、believing that everything she had trusted in for over ten years had been a lie now stood at the precipice between life and death A strong wind blew. I grimaced as warm droplets of rain threw themselves into my eyes. So Mitsuki cried out. Was so gentle. The tension that had tightened in my chest began to loosen into relief. At last, Marika turned back to us. Her expression was bright and cheerful. Just then, there was a powerful gust of wind. It was only then that we remembered that we were at a great height in an unfenced area. We had no way of standing against the wind. In addition, Marika was just near the edge. Her beautiful hair spread out like a fan. It almost seemed to drag her back, causing her entire body to tilt over the ledge. I felt like I could still make it. She was close. 
Even if Marika had lost her balance, she wouldn't fall immediately. So I could still make it. Or so I thought. Ah. I slept on the wet floor. For a moment, my entire body seethed and then went cold. I struggled upright with all of my might and began staggering forward. But even my greatest efforts were in vain. I swam through the air. Whoa. I stretched out my right arm as far as I could. But by then, Marika was already falling. Ah! <laughs> I had managed to grab onto her, just barely. But the crisis wasn't over yet. I can't stop! Thanks to the momentum of her fall on the wet floor, my body was continuing to slide. I slid out to my hips, and then the distant ground below came into view. I'm going to fall! I closed my eyes tightly. There was nothing to grab onto, and no one way to get back onto my feet. And yet... Huh? Despite half of my body leaning over the ledge, I stopped. <laughs> ah. The girls were grabbing onto my legs. D do you think you can pull me back up? I managed to ring out the words, but it sounded like they were at their limits already. What could we do? There was no way anyone was going to find us here on the clock tower on a rainy night. Calling out wouldn't work either. Our voices wouldn't travel ten meters in the heavy rain. What do we do? What do we do? Think, damn it! Not a chance. Like you said before, you still got a lot of learning to do about righteousness, right? I don't want you to die, but I don't want you to die either, right? Isn't that right, Marika? I want to hear what you have to say, Marika. Who cares what God, your grandmother, or anyone else says? What's important is what you have to say. Isn't that right? I raised my voice, giving her hand a squeeze trying to communicate my wish with her, that she would understand me. Listen to me, Marika. Right, that's all I need to power me through. Despite the situation we were in, we exchanged a smile. Hey, can you get that phone working? What? My body moved forward five centimeters and then stopped. I almost had a heart attack. At least it's not five centimeters per second. Oh man. Marika had one hand free. All we could do was pray that she didn't drop it. <laughs> Just then, Marika received an incoming call. It caused her hand to tremble. Ah! What I had feared had became reality. The cell phone, her our lifeline, had dropped and stopped in midair. <laughs> the strap caught on her pinky finger. <laughs> That voice. Was that her grandmother? Marika looked up into my eyes, uncertain. Of course, we both knew that we had to get help as soon as possible. In order to do that, we had to hang up on her immediately and call someone else. But right now, this call was important to Marika's relationship with our grandmother. With that thought in mind, I met Marika's eyes and nodded. I think that you should tell her. Hi. Marika. 
か雨の音がするが外にいるのかいそれに今の声まさか男が一緒じゃないだろうねおばあさまマリカ答えなさいお前は一体何をしているんだいおばあさまに宣言しておきたいことがありますえ聞こえなかったのかい私は答えなさいと私は今後私が正しいと思うことだけをしますマサヤ君を不当な手段で追い出すことは正しくないことであると私は判断しましたですのでおばあさまのご指示無視させていただきますま待ちなさいマリカお前は一体何を今立て込んでいますのでこれで失礼しますそれでは待ちなさいピッピッ The call cut off. This time, Marika manipulated the buttons skillfully and called the school for help. And so, we were saved just in the nick of time. A lecture was waiting for us afterwards, but Marika's presence there meant that we weren't interrogated too closely. ミツキやまして野生徒会長のマリカまでいますこれは一体どういうことなのでしょう申し訳ありませんすみませんああ As the two girls bowed, the headmistress looked at them with a troubled expression あなた方は謝罪なしですか I'm sorry, we saved her life. Why do we have to apologize? I'm sorry. Sumimasen. The two of us bowed hastily, though Rise couldn't hide her dissatisfaction, and the headmistress let out a sigh. Ma, I did so. Marika mo iruijo. Gonkai no koto a tanna ru asobi dewa nakata no de so. Sangate kamaimasen. Sore kara. Sugu ni ofro ni hide na sai. Oh, that's right. We had been summoned to the headmistress's office still soaking wet. Not even the presence of Marika and Mitsuki had softened her enough to let us change first. Okonogi Masayaku, Kaze o Hikanai yo, Atatakaku ste yasun de kudasai yo. Ah, right, thank you. I couldn't believe the headmistress would be nice to me. I blinked a few times, pinched myself, make sure I wasn't dreaming, and then nodded in confusion. Maybe she really is just a nice person. I kind of feel bad for getting the wrong idea about her. Nani shiro. 君と学校側はもう実質的に無関係です。責任を問われてはたまりませんからね。And there it is. 実質的よくわからないおっしゃるようですね、校長先生。You say snap the words out quickly. 何がわからないことがありますか明日、報告されることが決定しているのですよ。だから実質的と言っているのです<笑>果たしてそうでしょうかえええお二人は決定していると思いますそうわかりませんねえ<笑>早く行きなさい本当に風邪をひきますよ The rain passed quickly. By the time we got back to the dorm, the moon was bright in the night sky. She turned to us in the entryway and bowed low to us. ごめんなさい罠にかけたことですか
それもありますが分けても今夜のことです Well, if we hadn't showed up, you would most likely be dead by now. You got some thinking to do, I guess. Hi. Before Marika had fallen into depression, she had always had a confident smile on her face. You know, being too happy can also be a sign of depression. Seeing her cow like this was definitely strange. Hey, there's no point dwelling on the past. Let's just be glad it's over. We can move on. So, it's a good thing. So, it's a good thing. So, it's a good thing. Those things? But, it's a good thing. 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 It's a good t h i Well, I had to say what I had to say. Otherwise, I never would have had the chance to. She fell. I think I got excited. It was a pretty rude thing to say. Wow, really? Then I. I really. I got nothing. My voice trailed off weakly as I saw Marika approach me. Um. Her face was very close to mine. Her cheeks were brightly flushed. Maybe because of the rain. Well. Right. What is it? Pressed her face in close to mine. While I didn't necessarily mind the proximity, I pulled back reflexively. Marika Sama, Kao got Chikasugi Ashima Senkoto? Marika pulled away from me quickly, leaving only a sweet fragrance behind. Ah, strawberries. What in the world just happened there? What are you shaking me for? Alright, whoa! ちの出る幕はないかもしれませんね。でもこの気持ちは生涯忘れないわ。きっと。あの話には驚きましたね。Oh For a flashback. Great. What? If there's something like that, Marika's mother won't be able to do it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. マリカ様も思い切ってベーズなんてことをしたんでしょうけど。We were all in a panic, you know, and wondering if Marika had fallen or at least decently worried about her either way. まあ、それもそうか。それで私気になったものだから。
We all exchanged glances. でも、リセットら珍しいわね。え何がですかそんな風に外堀を埋めるみたいなやり方をするなんて、あなたならさっさと聞きに行きそうなものだけど。あ、そうですね。伊勢さんは思い立ったが吉日を地で言っていますし。そこまでせっかちじゃないわよ。実を言うとちょっと怖いのよ。怖い。せっかく仲直りして元の親友に戻ってなのにまだお姉様に惹か